When can I get back to rubbing my eyes after having LASIK? Believe it or not, this is a common question I get asked from patients and my answer is, don't do it. Don't rub your eyes ever, even if you're not gonna have LASIK. The reason for that is decades of rubbing the eyes, putting pressure from your finger or your knuckles on your cornea, the clear part of the eye, that can actually lead to thinning over time. And that eye rubbing, and it doesn't even have to be eye rubbing, let's say you sleep uh, at night on your stomach and your face is in the pillow and that constant pressure from the pillow over decades leads to some thinning, that's a condition called keratoconus and that can actually cause really sometimes complicated issues with the eyes that can result in you needing specialty contact lenses or glasses to see and if the condition keeps progressing you end up needing a procedure called corneal cross -lining. Now look, if you're trying to maybe just itch the corner of your eye or clean off your eyelashes, that's perfectly fine. But rubbing directly on your eyes with a finger or your knuckle, don't do that. Especially in the early post-operative period, the last thing we want is for the LASIK flap that was just created and smoothly laid down to now be disrupted and then that leads to some wrinkling or what we call striae in the LASIK flap. Look, if that happens and it's picked up the first day or the first week after surgery, it's not a big deal. It's easy to lift that LASIK flap, smooth it back into place, lay it back down, and really there's no consequence. But if you're really rubbing your eyes and then you're not seen for let's say a month or something like that, that's when there can be long-term issues.